hello YouTube show you guys how to um set up um Google Mail let's say you're on a company and it's using Google as like the server for its email I'll show you how to set that up so you can get the push contacts email and calendar okay, first of all you're gonna want to hook up your iPhone or iPod touch to your Mac or PC and um sync it so you have um 2.2 so you, so you have the new software 2.2 point one whatever it is and then you're gonna need to um, sync your phone with iTunes so all your con current contacts are stored in address book or any other application that may be for Windows or Mac and then you're gonna want to um, go into your iPhone sorry let me get you a good view on this yeah you want to go into your iPhone sorry my camera's reversed I don't know why then you're gonna want to go go into settings. Then you're gonna want to go down into mail, 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 contacts and calendars. Hold on. Let me get this shot. Let me see if it's if I hold it sideways. I think you can. Yeah, you guys can see. Well, I already set mine up. I'll show you how to. You go to add account. Yeah, that's perfect. You go to, let me show you again. All right, so you go into settings, then you go into mail, contacts, calendar, then you go to add account, then you go to Microsoft Exchange. Okay, All right, well, I'll show you how I set that up though. All right, basically you go into your account, Okay, first you're going to want to put in your email that it is from what company you are. Like it's going to be, let's say, I don't know, the, the um, first part, then add some, your company's name, dot com or dot info, whatever. And then your server, you're going to want your server to be m.google.com. You don't want a domain. You put in your username and password for that um email, and then you and then you're basically done. It's easy, and then it's gonna let you um pick see see with Active Sync. Sync so the mail you can put it on push up con and the calendar can be put on and off. But I just keep mine for mail, but you can turn any of those on. And let me tell you why you needed to have it synced. See, when you turn this on, it's going to tell you, syncing with Exchange, remove your existing contacts from your iPhone. So if you want the contacts to be synced, you're going to have to um, re-put in your contacts later on. Yeah, and same thing goes for calendars, which is probably already synced up in address book for me. So that's it. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.